Mr. Kimmelman, won't this give Comcast more leverage? Uh, absolutely, Senator Frank. I'm, even those who are arguing about these other competitors, mostly they're they're giving us um, examples of things either that just show the market is highly concentrated but not monopolistic, or they're quite futuristic. And we did use the Uverse numbers, uh, Professor Yu, in our in our analysis. There is enormous market power here that could be leveraged, and on top of that, there is the very popular NBCU programming that could be leveraged, and that understandably maximizes profits for Comcast to keep it in a big bundle to charge as much as possible, and the increasing trend for consumers is to buy at least two services, broadband and video, if not three. And so they know that they can drive up prices to competitors and uh, benefit from uh, raising their rivals' costs. And if, if some people want to drop those rival services, it is most likely going to be business going to them. That is where their financial incentive lies, and then we'd expect them to follow through on that. Those are the kinds of concerns that, on the public record, were in the uh, the FCC ruling on NBCU and content, Comcast um, and in the DOJ, uh, and I imagine they will be relevant here as well.